You guys were saying earlier that Davis was competitive. I guess it was the captain Davis. Well, he yeah. wanted to be on the fire before, you know, another engine. He was, he was a whole family. Oh, yeah. Oh, this guy. But you, you got to give him credit. The you man knew credit. his job. I didn't like him, but he was, he was a fireman. That guy knew his job. And he, and he, went, he made us know his that's job. That's right. And, you know, he, he instilled in us pride in our uniform, mm -hmm. pride oh, yeah. in that station. That's right. Yeah. It had to be that, neat. Not only pride that, yeah, oh, yeah, you stood roll call, man. You better have your shoes shine. That tie Everything. better be just right. Yeah, and only one Lloyd Booth we all get. <laughs> Who used to call him Hoseman Nasty? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. Uh, he wore that uniform all ever since his street clothes, yeah. his running clothes, yeah. everything. Yeah, he, uh, and, and, and he, and, and training was his big thing. Yeah. We had to and have he knew training. It. And he knew what he was doing. I mean, and this, he, he pride in that station because that station was spotless. Spotless. I mean, spotless. Are you a smoker? You better not flick no ashes on the apparatus floor. No. And the, the upstairs, we, we, we would strip and, and wax those floors every seven weeks. Whatever platoon he went over to, you strip those floors and, and re-wax the floors. Wow. Right? And every time you went out on a run, you come back, you were assigned to a fender. The four fenders, there were two apparatus, that's eight. And the eight guys, yeah. this is yours, the right front. Left front, and you had to. He'd put his hand under there if he got any dirt. Well, you were in trouble. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah, he yeah, he was he was stickler on cleanliness, and you know them windows got washed every week. Oh and, yeah. Uh, the couldn't, brass couldn't got polished them. twice a week. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. He, yeah, he was a stickler. Well, you, I mean, you, and, you, you know, know, after a while, you you felt pride. To, Cause especially you get detail in white station and they were filthy. Mm -hmm. You know, you look at damn. I don't want to sit here. You know, or something That's like right. that. You know, you don't want to put your lunch in the refrigerator. You know, <laughs> that kind of stuff with it, because you're not used to that. Mm -hmm. You know, and uh, it was, uh, yeah. He, he, he I, you got to give him credit. I mean, yeah, he, he you, might, you didn't like and him he personally, but he, oh yeah. Well, what I remember the first. What was, what was his name? James G. James, James. G. I don't know what the G stood for, but James G. Davis. Yeah. James something. I don't he know. He lived what the up G on uh, Jefferson, Jefferson Street. Street. I remember one night I was in twenty nine, so I was, I was acting in in the in the third, and uh, I told the driver, "Let's take a ride." I went. I went and visited him. Oh yeah. He, oh, he was glad to see me. Come on in. He said, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I was in the car. He was, that he night. was all fireman, boy. Yeah. yeah. He had. You he was retired at that time. Yeah. Yeah. I interrupted you. Uh, yeah. Well, you were about to say say something about Davis. I interrupted you. Oh, a lot of, I could say a lot of things. <laughs> he had he had a he had a closet up on the second floor. Uh, we used to call Fort it Knox. Fort Knox. <laughs> <laughs> and Teddy Reed and I, and up over the door was a transom. So we'd get a chair and put up and go climb over there and go down and get soap and stuff. Of course, he was tough. Whenever the stuff was issued. He just dish it out. He he make yeah. sure you didn't he, well run through it. You know? <laughs> well, in those days you didn't get for so much anyhow. We yeah. had to bring our own rags. Yeah, know? that's right. I was going to say our yeah. rags. Yeah, you they we bring they, our own they rags. Didn't issue rags, but there's some things you you got, and he he kept them locked up, make yeah. sure that we had enough to go around, and yeah, polish and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, brass <laughs> so, polish. Oh God, <laughs> they had the two poles and that steamer. God. Mm. Oh, boy. and that was done. Twice, twice a week. Twice a week. Yes. And you couldn't skip it. No. But he coming in and look and see. Oh yeah. It's like he said, everything. Yeah. Floors had to be spotless. That's the right. Wall. And then like you in know, the corners and around the back of a door or something. They don't leave no. You work that, swing that door out and clean that floor and back of there. We had two guys on our platoon, Whitby and Ito, mm -hmm. Jim Brown and I have all, and we were all on the A platoon. Mm -hmm. So the spring cleaning, you know how they had to wash the walls. Oh, yeah. We yeah. had to wash all the walls, oh, the yeah. paints and everything. Yeah, spring cleaning. So Whitby and Ito were over there on one side. They're washing. Jim Brown and I was over on the other side. So Jim Brown, he was like me. We would wash him. We would get on. Uh, and those guys over there. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, nobody did. That's so did the captain. Come on down from there. 
you sit down here and watch Alma and, and Brown. <laughs> I said, it don't tell them. <laughs> watch us. And then you tell them to sit down there. And you know, spring, spring cleaning was supposed to be uh, uh, department-wise, all supposed to be all over the city, yeah, all the states, but, and the chief wasn't. was supposed to come around and inspect. Well, you know, you, you visited all them states. Oh, yeah. All them states that were nowhere in <laughs> Oh, yeah. Well, the, the chief would come to Engine 11. He'd come down, sit in the kitchen, talk. He said, you don't need me looking here. He said, because I know this yeah. place is spotless. I don't have to look at nothing. Right. He'd go sit in the kitchen and, and have coffee with everybody, talk about, you know, yeah. 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 He says, no need me looking at anything. Yeah, he knew it, yeah, yeah, he knew he, it he was knows, all right. It's that way all the time, not only in the springtime. Yeah, you've got to give Jim Davis credit for that. Yeah. Remember in the, uh, in the apparatus floor right up in the front, you had the Maltese uh, uh, cross painted in the floor? Yeah. Yeah. On the concrete floor. But like the, like our badge, but it was in colors of red and, and oh, blue wow. and all. Big thing in the middle of the floor there. Yeah, it was beautiful. 